Hello everyone, welcome to Burnett's BioCube 32 gallon saltwater reef aquarium. This is my first video, I hope you enjoy. I've had the aquarium set up for three months. I want to talk with you today about getting rid of the Aptasia that I found within the last two weeks hiding in live rock. Although there are only two or three tentacles visible, I want to get it before it spreads. In looking straight through the aquarium glass, you could see one, possibly two tentacles of the Aptasia. So I'm going to actually show you what the Aptasia looks like now that I've taken the coral from the aquarium. Zoom in closely. And you can see there, in direct center of the frame, that there are at least two tentacles of Aptasia. We don't want to harm the coral, so we're actually going to use some lemon juice, a hypodermic needle and syringe, some rinse water. I'm going to remove the coral, inject or actually pour just a few drops of lemon juice using the syringe directly onto the Aptasia and see what the overall end result is. So stay tuned. We're now going to take the coral out of the water from the aquarium. I have some rinse water here as well. I'm going to slowly drop the lemon juice directly onto the Aptasia there on the edge of the live rock. May kill actually some of the algae growing on the rock. We're going to see what we can do. Okay, I've actually placed 12 drops directly onto the area where the Aptasia was visible. I'm going to wait just a possibly 30 seconds or so to allow it to quote unquote cook the Aptasia. And then we will rinse, replace back in the salt water from the aquarium. And then I will discard this as a final rinse as I remove the coral and place it back in the tank. Okay, we're going to rinse. And then I'm actually going to place the rock back into the salt water from the aquarium to turn the camera back around and we will focus on the area where the Aptasia was hiding earlier. No more Aptasia. I may have injured or possibly killed two stalks of the Xenia, but we will check on that when we get it back in the tank. But we're going to get it back into the tank and again we'll discard the solution here that I took from the tank so that it acts as a second rinse. As you can see here, the Aptasia is cooked and hopefully this will be the only Aptasia on this live rock. If not, we will come back and remove any more we find. Doesn't appear to have had any adverse impact on the Xenia and that is the only piece of Aptasia I have found in the tank in three months. Uh, this guy has been in the tank for probably a month and a half to two and just noticed the Aptasia within the last week and when the second tentacle appeared 
I was certain that's what it was and wanted to get rid of it as soon as possible. So thank you guys for watching.